Another thing that I love about Christmas is the sweets and the chocolates that can be eaten. I love the candy cane. Did you know that the story of the candy cane is a story that points us towards Jesus? The candy cane is shaped like a crook, like a shepherd's crook, to remind us of the shepherds, the first group of people to go and see Jesus. But if you turn it upside down, it looks like the letter J or J. In the phonetic alphabet, it's Juliet. But for us, it's the letter J or J for Jesus. And to remind us of Jesus born in the stable. Candy canes now come in all sorts of different colours, but traditionally they're red and white. And they too remind us of Jesus. The white that Jesus was pure, like pure snow, where there's not been any footprints or anyone walking in it. Jesus was without fault. He had no sin. So what about the red? Well, that reminds us of the end of Jesus' life, when he gave his blood for us to be saved so we could get beside God. He took the place of our sin. So when at Christmas time you're munching your candy canes, remember, remember the shepherds, remember Jesus born in the stable, remember that he was without fault, but he took his place and spilled his blood for us. <laughs>